I am Anil Kumar and here is another test question from quadratic equations. The question here is a triangle has base 2x plus 1 and height of 6x minus 3. What value of x would give an area 240 meters square? Round your answer to the nearest 100. As you know, area of a triangle is half base times height. Now we are given area as 240, so we can write 240, it's in meter square, so all units will be in meters. Half of base is 2x plus 1 and height is 6x minus 3. Now we can multiply by 2 uh, on both the sides, so we get 480 equals to 2x, I mean 2x plus 1 times 6x minus 3 that is x now we can open this bracket on the right side so 2x times 6x is 12x squared and 2x times minus 3 is minus 6x multiplying by 1 we get plus 6x minus 3 now we can combine these terms so we get 12x squared minus 3 okay and on the left side we have 480 now we can bring 480 to the right side so we get 0 equals to 12 x square minus 3 minus 480 that gives you a quadratic equation which is 12 x square minus 483 correct so that is the quadratic equation which you need to solve. Now uh, we could factor 12 and solve it. That's one way of doing it. We could actually take square root of this and then solve it. So there are a couple of ways at this stage where we can solve this particular equation. Correct? So let us do one thing. Uh, let us factor 12. So we have got 0 equals to 12. We can factor 12 from here. We get x square minus 483 divided by 12, right? So that gives us two possible values for x and those values are plus minus square root of 483 divided by 12 square root. At this stage we can use the calculator and find the answer. So we have square root of 483 divided by 12. That gives you, let's find decimal value for this. It is 6.3442, right? Now, plus and minus. Both values are 6.344. It says round your answer to nearest 100. So this could be rounded to plus and minus 6.34, right? Since this is less than 5. So we can write x value as plus minus 6.34. So that is the answer for this triangle to have the given area of 240 meters square. Now since the units are meter, we'll write x is equals to, it cannot be negative because uh, if I write negative here, then what do I get? One of these values will become negative. I should show you that also. Okay. Let's check. So we have two possible values, x is positive or negative. Now base is equals to 2x plus 1, correct? So it is very clear that if I write minus 6 here, then what will be the base? It will be 2 times minus 6.34 plus 1, which is going to give us 8, 6 and 12 with a negative sign plus 1. That will give us negative 11.68. Now the dimensions cannot be negative, correct? In fact, in this particular question, when we have base as 2x plus 1, x should be greater than half, minus half, correct? Otherwise, we'll get, get a negative value. So therefore, the negative value is not valid and only possible value is plus 6.34 meters for x, correct? Since we have to write only x value, 200 place we should include units in this so x is equal to 6.34 meters for us 
I hope it is important to appreciate here that we should find the restrictions to x and then include those restrictions while writing our answer. Also include units for x in your answer. Thank you and all the best.